I want to tell you guys the story on how I got my Oculus Quest 2. But, uh, you want me to prove it? Did I have one? There you go. Here it is. And I, I have to say this is better than the PlayStation VR, I will say. And here are the controllers. And I have to say I'm still trying to get used to these new controllers. Because I'm still an Oculus uh, rookie. So what is the story on me getting an Oculus Quest 2? Constantly in my live streams, I've mentioned my PSVR, the PlayStation VR, keeps flickering pinch black. Like it's blinking its eyes. It does that every few seconds, and it really, it really a pain to play Rec Room or any other VR game when it does that. Oh, especially when I'm playing quests. When that happens while I'm in the action, that's a death sentence. It It's really annoying. When I'm trying to play a quest, or do a parkour with screen going pinch black flickering like it's blinking its eyes I'm like I can't do anything about it I'm like I can't do anything I can't kill enemies on a quest I can't um see what I'm doing on a PvP or any other game in Rec Room I mean this is why I chose to get an Oculus Quest 2 because of a flickering screen now if you don't know what I'm talking about now, here's your proof. See? There you go. Yeah, just don't end up like I did. And there was actually a story of uh, getting the Oculus Quest 2. My best friend heard me complaining about it constantly and constantly. And C suggested me to get an Oculus Quest 2. Because um, it's wireless and it doesn't have that black screen of death issues that I kept on having. But I decided, you know what? I'm tired of this black screen of death. I'm going to get the Oculus Quest 2. So I went over to Amazon and I ordered it. And I was getting very hyped. Like, alright, I'm, I'm ready for this thing to arrive. But the day after I purchased it, I received an email stating that they have announced a recall. So they had to cancel my order and refunding me. So I got upset and really pissed off all because of a recall of a skin irritation. So I bought the headset, but now sadly I could not purchase it. I mean, I did purchase it, but they had to cancel my order and refunding me because of this recall over a skin irritation. And those who had an Oculus prior to the recall, they had a... They gave out a free silicone to all other Oculus Quest users, like my best friend. And I was really mad and upset, but I understand that it's for uh, health purposes. So then a month after, uh, one month after the recall was announced, it was on, I think, the 24th of August? Yeah, I think August 24th, it was back in stock. So I immediately, this time, I ordered off the Oculus shop. It's not Amazon, but the Oculus Shop is where I ordered it. And it said it was going to come in on um, Tuesday of next week, the week after I purchased it. But unexpectedly, it came in Saturday. While well, I was playing Rec Room VR on my PlayStation, but then I was notified saying that I got a package in the mail. And I said, but I didn't order anything. So I grabbed it and said, oh, wait a minute. I think that's my Oculus. So, I logged off Rec Room, opened up my Oculus, and there it was. The Oculus Quest 2 has finally arrived. So then I had the time to set it up. Get it all set up, hooked up, get, the, get Rec Room, because that is the, immediately the first game I had to get. I got Rec Room, logged into it, and announced to my friends in Rec Room that I, I got it. I got the Oculus. But I got a help from another friend on um, trying to get used to the controls. Now that's what I'm still trying to get used to are these uh, controllers. It has two analog sticks. That's, and it has uh, trigger buttons right here and there. 
So I'm I'm still new at this with this Oculus Quest. So I'm still an Oculus rookie. So I'll give you out some pros and cons about this. Another pro is um it's wireless, so I can take it anywhere I like. That's one. But the other pros, I'll have to look inside it. But the con is the battery is too short. It only lasts for, I think, about two hours long of battery. So every time I play Rec Room, they're always saying battery low. Even when I start playing Rec Room, it's full charged. So I think around an hour, 15 minutes, an hour and a half later, it goes low battery. So I have to grab that charger and plug it in. Oh, that's another disadvantage, another con. The charger is too short, way too short. So I bought this longer charger. Hold on. Oh, it's all tangled up. So then I have, this is actually um, another charger that came in separately. So I bought this. And it does the job. This it works better because it's longer, not rather than shorter, and it's a mess. And actually, I also bought Beat Saber. I've heard about Beat Saber. I watched gameplay footage of it, and it looks really fun. It's like VR Guitar Hero, a rock band, whatever. So those are the only games I have. Rec Room and Beat Saber. That's all I have on my Oculus. So speaking of Oculus, let's take a look inside it. Well, I have to say... PSVR doesn't have anything like this. See, these are all the footage I have recorded. A rec room. Here it is. I'm down to 20% and my controllers are 80%. And you also have virtual environments like this one here. You can go to Space Station, Cyber City, which is this right here. You can go to this one, um, Winter Lodge, Desert, Dome. So let's check out Bubbles. Yeah, I don't like this one. Let's try the desert. That's my phone going off. I don't know if you already heard it. Here, let's check out Space Station. That one's probably my second favorite. And Cyber City. You know what? I would have choose either this one or Space Station. So, yeah. I mean, I really like this one. You see, headset power is low. That is one of the disadvantages on um, Oculus, because the battery is so low. But one more advantage thing, when I'm playing Rec Room, it doesn't as lag as much as the PlayStation does. I think I made the right decision to get a Oculus Quest 2. I mean, hey, the price, $300, not bad. I'll take it, $300. Cheaper than the, the PSVR, how, is it? Or is it the same price? How much was PSVR, Four, $400 or same price? Whatever. Oculus Quest is better, I'm gonna confirm. This is better than PSVR. Yeah, as you can see, I have it on the charger plugged into my, my wall. You see what I mean by long charger? There you go. So I do not recommend using the, the really tiny charger that, that came with the box. I recommend getting a longer charger. That's what I recommend. I don't recommend the, the small one that comes in the box. Those are my thoughts and my experience on Oculus Quest 2. I've had this thing for a week, so I wanted to give you all my thoughts about it, why I think 
that this is better than PlayStation's VR. So, this is Mr. Mario Fan 12. That was my thoughts on Oculus Quest 2.